So, it helps when you're using OBS if you use the game capture option for capturing game footage. I know it's a stretch of a concept, but work with me. Anyway, now that little bit of uh, stupidity aside, I'm gonna just do some nuclear throne to uh, acclimate myself to the technology. Now that you can actually see what I'm playing instead of just listening to me in some kind of creepy podcast version. Uh, fuck it, let's random, see what happens. Blech. I am this character. I don't play this character because, well, it feels unfinished. I mean, what the hell was that? <laughs> is that the blast armor? I think that's what that is. Isn't she supposed to, like, eventually... Uh, he or she, I'm not stuck. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, the biggest thing is that she sounds like fish, and, or he sounds like fish. It sounds like fish, so I'm like, my brain is a little crossed. You know, one of those portal strike dogs. Plus that is a weird mechanic, too, where I don't... I literally don't get as much, uh... What do you call it? Freaking... Radiation, because I gotta get the ammo for the big nuke thing she has. I'm gonna call it a she. It looks like one. I might be wrong, but whatever. Um... I have no idea what to pick here. I mean, I love bolt marrow, so I'm just gonna pick it. Hope I find a crossbow. Put it that way. So I don't even know if her blue gun is like any sort of good compared to regular weapons. Yeah, blast armor, there we go. Yeah. I don't know if her gun is like better than other guns, but I kinda like it, so I'm just gonna use it. I'm gonna go to the YV level with the screwdriver, but uh, shotgun. Get my portal strike, dog. Oh fuck. Portal strike. And that big like carpet bombing thing you get to do. Like that. <laughs> Definitely a waste of it, but I wanted to show it off and this is where you use it. Wow, that does like no damage. Maybe that's better for clearing out crowds than it is on bosses. Yeah. Scarra's got all these amazing abilities, but like... You know, she's paying for it by, uh being constantly hounded by the police. It's an interesting gimmick, I'll give it that much. But, um... A little annoying. I'm gonna take that grenade launcher when the level loads in. I'm gonna take a scary face so shit dies faster. It's the only talent in the game that's effect- talent. Mutation in the game that is effectively a damage upgrade for every weapon in the game. Oh. Because it's literally just... Oh, you're an enemy? You have less hit points now, have fun. Got explosives from that? What the hell? I'm very confused. Oh fuck, assassin! No! Ow. Okay, so I'm almost dead. And I am dead. <laughs> okay, let's try that again with a character I actually know how to play. I mean, there's not a lot to this game in terms of playing each character, but like... There are little in in idiosyncrasies that you need to be worried about. Excuse me while I take a sip of my coke here. I'd love to have a brand deal, but I'm such a new YouTuber, I don't think I can manage to swing that. Uh, you know what? <laughs> Steroids! I love this character. All the bullets! Just fire all the bullets! Fuck consequences! And fuck everything on the receiving end of your gun! <laughs> ah! Wow, level 2 already. This will happen when you get a bunch of those maggots, I guess. There you go, they're worth a lot. A wrench. If I get another one, I'll go double melee. Oh, man. You see, I could go double melee and have long arms, or I could stick with guns and have my throne butt, which is an amazing ability. So probably gonna stick with the throne butt, because, you know, guns are a little better than melee in this, even though some of the melee weapons later are pretty good, but in general, you find more guns than melee weapons. Because, you know... Oh, shit. Ow. Look at that. All that, all that, all them free bullets. 
And hey, bullet weapons. There you go. Gotta remember, gotta click both weapons. Gotta click both buttons. Gotta fire all the bullets. Oh, hello, golden scorpion douchebag. Get out of here. Oh, God. Oh, and we're alive. Uh, hello, boss. Eat tons of lead. Ow. Okay. Still alive. Still kicking. I can eat one bullet. I can't go for seconds, though. Oh, oh there's the second wrench. <laughs> we could have had double melee stupidity with the uh, steroids. Oh, well. Hey, a shotgun. Uh, I don't like bloodlust because the proc rate is like stupidly low. It's like less than 10%. <laughs> Set as it like immediately goes off. I mean, if you're hitting enough enemies, it'll go off eventually, but... Oh, I feel, I feel like I'm constantly like, come on, bloodlust, come on, bloodlust, and it never goes off when I need it. Or it goes off like 10 times when I'm already full. You know, it's kind of pointless. No, uh, don't shoot me with your freaking shotguns. Man, a lot of alligators. Ooh, that was a explody frog, dude. Grenade launcher. Eh, sure. Throw the pizza turtle level. Ninja turtle level. If I can find the thing where it is. Uh, where's the... Where's the manhole cover? Manhole cover. Where are you? There you are. Hey, kaboosh. There we go! Look at that jazzy as fuck music. <laughs> ah. You know, Second Stomach is pretty good already, but I'd love it if it worked on all sources of healing, because then Bloodless would be amazing. Because then it would be literally a med kit every couple of kills, which is pretty amazing. I mean, one every kill, couple of kills isn't too bad, but like... I don't know, it doesn't have enough kick. Especially since in this game, like, some of the lowest damage you can take is three. So... Yeah, I'm gonna take it. It's still pretty good. Remember, I have a grenade launcher. Do not fire the other weapon right now. Ah, uh, no. Leonardo Donatello, don't fuck with me. Splinter, get out of here. Come on, Raphael. I'll leave you alone, Michelangelo. Double grenade launcher, is that a thing? That is a thing, I don't want to do it. <laughs> I don't want to do it. It's gonna get me killed. If I had boiling veins, I'd be all over it, but not right now. Pizza? Oh, no pizza. You know, I just had dinner. I could go for a pizza after this level. Scrapyard. Got a grenade launcher here, so I can actually blow up the flame traps, which is pretty good. And YV's car! Man, I think you take a lot of bullets. Oh, fuck. No. <laughs> No, don't blow me up. There we go. Oh, there goes all my cover. <laughs> oh, wow, that sucks. Oh, thank you, second stomach. I feel like you have to thank you, mutations. Otherwise, they feel unappreciated. Where do we get a sniper rifle? Kind of cool. I mean, I guess that's what the crossbow is, but like, it would be neat if there was a bullet weapon that did like a shit ton of damage per bullet, but fired really slowly. But I guess they want to keep bullet weapons being the Daka Daka, which I mean, I can understand. I can understand. Boop. Gotcha. Plasma gun. Not one of my favorites. Mostly because it's kind of finicky and getting people to get hit with it. If I'm going energy weapons, I definitely prefer laser weapons because, you know, it's a hitscan weapon, basically. For those of you not in the know, hitscan means the moment you click the trigger, the weapon hits. There's no travel time. Not a lot of them in this game. The closest you get is like a crossbow, which is one again, one of my favorite weapons. Ooh, Jesus, so many robots. Um, can I get that? Oh, what's going on? Well, that works too. I was gonna try to like trick shot it in there, but I just blow up, just blow up the world, and fire it in the debris. That works too. God damn it! Come on, get in there. I have no excuse.
I have no excuse. Oh, assassin! Hello! Yeah, get out of here, you little bastard. Yep. Lightning rifle. I forget, did I like this weapon or no? You know what, I'm running out of ammo anyway for the for the bullets, so screw it. Grenade launcher, lightning pistol, lightning gun. Whatever the fuck this thing's called, lightning rifle, that's the one. Uh, oh. hmm. Basically, I'm looking between these two, because this one's cute. Although it kind of looks like fish is growing a dick, which is a little suggestive. And this one I just don't like at all. Because it doesn't do enough damage to warrant taking damage. Uh, I know it's supposed to be something that happens like accidentally, but it benefits you, but like, I still don't think it's worth over something that's a little more active, like just having more ammo, or sucking up all the project all the uh, pickups on screen, which I'm going to probably pick. I wish I could figure out the rhyme or reason about whoa, where uh, this freaking gun shoots. Oh, hello, big dog. Oh, wait. Start firing my weapons until you fall over dead. Like that. Triple machine gun. Not a bad weapon, but no eagle eyes, no recycled land. Makes it a little finicky to use. See, why did that not hit him? Like, why did the lightning bolt go that way? I don't know. Almost halfway there. Boop! Boop! Man, the crystals are freaking tough. Ah! Uh. Shovel! Yeah, I'm kind of committed to using guns in this run now. I don't got. I didn't get. I didn't take that long arms earlier. Oh shit! Oh, that was close. I heard a crystal break. Okay. Game really wants me to double grenade launchers. <laughs> I'm not gonna do it. I've done it before. It gets you killed. It's funny though. Ow. Yeah. This is one of the reasons why I like the bazooka over the grenade launcher, despite like everyone and their mother hating the bazooka. I don't have to trick shot shit. I just have to point and click. I, I heard that was the point of guns. Ugh. 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 Not a very good selection. Why is it almost all the mutations that have fish on them are crap, except Strong Spirit? Which I'm not the biggest fan of either, just because it kinda doesn't work. Because this game doesn't have uh, hit stun invincibility when you get hit. So, like, you can get hit, trigger second term, Strong Spirit, and then get hit again immediately and die, and not even know what the fuck happened. Nom, 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 nom. Wow, these guys are kind of tough. Boop. Boop. Eh. Ow. Eh. Gotcha. Need launcher starting to lose a bit of its kick. Could use scary face. So much radiation. I can chuck cars at you. Definitely yeah, makes you think of the bully mongs in Borderlands 2. Although they don't do nearly as much freaking damage with them. Oh shit, no. You know, relative to your hit points in that game. Although I've never played it with like all the in nuke launcher. Jesus. Hyper rifle. 
hyper rifle. Uh, ah. Hyper rifle plasma gun. Plasma gun is not good. Laser rifle's good. There we go. Double laser. Double laser weapons. Now all I need is uh, laser brain, and I'll be in business. Back muscle wouldn't be bad either, even though I turned it down earlier. Ah. Uh. They really want me to take that extra foot. <laughs> I'm not doing it. Taking boiling veins, though. So I don't die from a car being thrown at me. Ah, bugger. Yeah, those guys don't quite die to one hit of a lightning gun and a laser rifle. And I wasn't realizing this until it was too late. Drat. I think I'll squeeze in one more, and then I'm gonna cut the recording, because I think it might be a little too big, because my YouTube channel is not amazing. I'm gonna play another character. Go with my best. Oh yeah, I have the bee skin on. <laughs> Forgot about that. Oh, robot. Robot's interesting. But he's not, like, bombastically interesting. Because, like, that's his special ability. He's efficient. He's like a little German car. He's a very efficient little machine. Which, don't get me wrong, I love it. I personally think, you know, give me a character that's efficient over a character that's big and flashy, like, almost any day of the week. I mean, I'll play the big flashy character for shits and giggles, but the character I beat the game with is usually the efficient one. I mean, I know you can't beat Nuclear Throne, but I've gotten the furthest with the robot. Although I think I had a steroids run where I got to the end game, so who knows. Disc gun. This is what I think of your disc gun. Nope. At least give me hit points. A non-explosive weapon that can kill you. Not something I'm a fan of. Throne butt, absolutely mandatory. Getting double drops from the gun eating is like pretty much absolutely mandatory. And relevant whenever you get it, really. Because like you don't need it right away, but you don't and yet like it's relevant if you were to got it like right before well not right before the throne, but like if you got it on like the last couple of levels, or if you got it like right now, like I just did. Heavy crossbow. Yeah, for those not in the know, this is also a robot's other ability. The fact that he finds fat swag pretty easily. Um, pick up the machine gun. Keep the heavy crossbow in case I get bolt and arrow, because that ability is amazing. Meow, down I go. No bolt and arrow, but I do have trigger fingers. That's another good one. And strong spirit, which is good, but I don't like it mechanically. Trigger fingers first, then. Man, heavy crossbow takes a while to reload, even with trigger fingers, Jesus. There we go. I was looking for the big rat. Shovel! I will take shovel with trigger, fr trigger fingers every day of the week. I will, however, use the crossbow to deal with the alligators, because... Screw getting shot in the face by a hillbilly alligator in sewer. And no, don't ask me why I think they're hillbillies. Like, the fact that they have a shotgun is like... I don't know, maybe I'm just like... racist against people with shotguns? I don't know. <laughs> Kinda bad, considering I like shotguns as a weapon in most games. I mean, unless they really, really fall under the video game shotgun problem. Where, you know, they atomize things at point-blank range, but they do, like, god-awful no damage at, like, anything further than your wrist. <laughs> Which I always found kind of stupid, but, I mean, it's, it's the way they're programmed sometimes. Max bolts, that's good. Shotguns are pretty good in this, because they do almost full damage at any range. They just have they just have fall-off on how far they shoot. Or how far they hit. Uh, second stomach, absolutely. Second stomach actually does work with... Uh, robots eating of guns. Which I hopefully will get to demonstrate very soon. Okay, no. No. 
Back off. Smash. Uh, noink. Nom. Aw. I got energy drops instead of, uh, health. But I had to get two drops, so that's still pretty awesome. Blow up the car. Smash. Smash. Why must we fight Robot Brothers? Because the humans commanded us to. I'm afraid that is true. Wrench. Otherwise known as fodder. Now, again, getting the ammo, not getting a health. Eh. Damn it. I don't want to go in there. <laughs> uh, okay. Don't forget to eat weapons. Yeah, it's... Pretty much what I always do on this character. It's what you do. Yeah, screw you, assassin. I really don't like assassins in this. Whoa! Hey, whoa, whoa! Oh man, that was a lot of, uh... That was a lot of damage. Ugh, I don't want to go down there yet. There's nowhere else to go. Yeah. The giant, like, freaking, uh... Ballista balls this thing fires are hilarious. Oh god. No. No. Don't know if you guys are catching my uh, steam overlay there. A buddy of mine talking about uh, hyperdimension. Oh, I pissed off the cops. Guys, I'm blue like you. Don't attack me. Oh god. I got a. Cr I, got a I opened the crown vault. Later, bitches! Mm, kinda didn't want to come here. I kinda don't want a crown. Because last time I got to the throne with the robot, I, uh... had a crown of guns! And I'm like, trying to get ammo from his big explosions, and I'm like, oh shit, I can't get ammo drops. But you know what? I don't have any, um... designs on winning in this run, so... I'm gonna take it again. <laughs> Bam. It's really good with a robot, but, like I said, it have, you have that... Oh! Uh, kind of not relevant. <laughs> yeah, hello, big dog. But uh, I think that'll be the end of the video. Hopefully this one renders properly this time. Ciao.